226 not years old event starts. <laughs> Congratulations. And listen, uh, if you're a historian and you know your facts and figures, you'll recall that Captain James Cook and Joseph Banks sailed into Botany Bay back in 1770. Just seconds later, Russell started racing a V8 supercar and he's been racing it ever since. And congratulations, mate. Oh, thanks, guys. I, I really wanted to come up here to get a pasting. But, uh, yeah, look, it's uh, it's been a good innings, really good. And uh, it's good to be out here, especially this is when it's worthwhile and hanging around this sport when you get to an event like this and seeing the thousands yeah. of people that are here. Absolutely unreal. 226 events, 524 races, 27 wins, but one pole position. What's wrong with these numbers? <laughs> yeah, well, if you look at my qualifying position today, you can see I've kept that uh, average up of having the only pole position, but uh, my weak link. Now, Scafie, you did a Guinness Book of Records thing a few years ago in a ute or whatever I recall, and you've had half a nibble at it this week. What's all that about? Well, exactly. Mine was like uh, 290 kilometres an hour in a ute. What was yours? Yeah, uh, balancing 10 caps. Oh, cool. Oh, 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 oh good, good under, gig. Under 25 Oh, look, oh, oh great. Are you seriously oh, trying to convince that? me that that's worthy of a spot in the Guinness Book of Records? This, the things you got to do for a headline. <laughs> like, hey, I, I've, wore, I've worn a wedding dress for a headline, so that was actually pretty mild. Come on. <laughs> hey, now, listen, hey, the classic is, classic, before we go any further, what do you reckon about one of the, the high-profile sporting blokes in this country? Here's some highlights an unbelievable career but what do you reckon about one of the highest profile sporting blokes in the country he's made his own he's made his own nickname up when did you just decide to be the enforcer how did that come about how did that come about well you know what the Janos are like in, in this game Scapey, and uh, they they, um, they give everyone a bit of a a, a bit of a nickname and uh, look I roll with it this um, is good I think you're on the receiving end of a few enforcers too enforcing now and then I'm not so sure about the enforcer anymore I got a feeling in the modern era you're the nicenator there hasn't been too much enforcing going on but this is a high point mate you're champion in 2005 a couple of Bathurst wins as well and we have a lot of fun with you and we have done for a long period of time but I meant don't quite do genuinely <laughs> no don't do that at home please when I saw you in Darwin and we talked about this uh, it's a great achievement now what about this this is when you were an enforcer because that was Mike Emery who was pointing the right way until you arrived well this was the days when I was um, uh, very silly and didn't worry about fines you see and uh, yeah look we um, I, I still don't think it was my fault no, no. Oh, well, come so did you I pay still... you paid for the cams extension the confederation of australian there, motorsport there, extension there, didn't there it? is a wing for me yeah and that, was, and that wasn't my fault that was greg murphy <laughs> who's in the commentary box with us this weekend and i'm sure he's got a point of view on that so yeah, this is back well, in the day this that was back in the day while. where the fines were a lot lower <laughs> now they're too high so she's no more of those antics <laughs> It's been an outstanding run. And what about this? I mean, we oh, can't let uh, you two I maniacs do a, this segment without... A, and I still don't reckon it was my fault. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you are kidding, aren't you? And the irony oh. in all this, folks, is that Scafie actually drove Russell's car here in Townsville a couple of years ago. And here's the square up. Oh. It's, it's I was just like... saying hello. I was waving to him. He didn't want to run me over. Oh, I, do. Oh, I was coming over saying good day. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, and, boy, hey, and boys, sorry, if I can just dive in here. Oh. This is all fairly recent stuff. This is Larko here, Russell. Yeah. Mate, like I said, this goes back 25 years. Now, the number on your car, 226 is your age. I take 25 years off that. So this is when you were 201 years old. Malala, mate. Remember South Australia? This is where the enforcer bit started, I reckon. Hey, have a look at this little bit of vision here. You remember this bit? Oh, how do I know yeah. you're going to be? Mate, oh, okay. yeah. Here yeah, we just, go. Can just, oh, oh, mate, you're you're right. kidding me. <laughs> have a look at this. I'm sure they're off and racing. Getting away very quickly on the inside was Larkin, but I think it will, will move up to pressure. Oh! Did you just tell the audience who won the race, mate? Uh, who won, actually? Who, oh, oh, I can't remember. Oh, it's, it's only gone blank. <laughs> <laughs> Did so you long. notice? Is there a common theme? Uh, None of those were Russell's fault. That's right. <laughs> Hey, what's this? Is it like a roasting or something? It oh, is. What's the deal with it? I'll come up here for a nice chat. It's the official Russell Ingle roast. Mental note, never come up here again. Now, listen, <laughs> take a breath and stop and think. Congratulations. Yes. Oh, thanks, guys. That's no, fantastic I, I do appreciate performance. it. Uh, we're Thank very you. proud of you. Proud thanks to be for here, the mate. support. The fans have been absolutely fantastic too, so thanks, guys. All no, three no. of them. Great They've job. really loved no, every really, second of it. Thanks, mate. Well done. Congratulations. Now, there's a lot going on here this weekend, and Barretts is right in the thick of it.